So recently on the channel I have shared two videos of two games that I have made that both hold the same ingredient to make the screen scroll. I'm Animated Alex, welcome back to the channel. Now that ingredient I'm talking about is a poke command. We poke the number 23692,255. And what that does is it keeps the screen continuously scrolling so it doesn't display the scroll question mark prompt. It just keeps automatically scrolling. Now I've put a little example program together just to show how it works. The program is called the Spectrum Matrix. And what I want it to do is to print zeros and ones randomly as it scrolls up the screen. Line 40, that is where my poke command is. And line 50, that is where my print statement is. And you'll notice at the end of that print statement, I've got 21 comma 31 apostrophe apostrophe. Now the scrolling is performed by this last print statement. So it's important that you have that in there as it's not going to work correctly. So remember, apostrophe, apostrophe. At line 60, I've included the out command. Now the out command is responsible for controlling the Spectrum loudspeaker. And also it controls the mic socket and the border colors as well. So for this example, I'm using out and port 254. The values for the loudspeaker are 16, the mic socket is 8, and the border values are 4, 2 and 1. So in this example, I've done out 254, comma, int, and then a random times 32. So anyway, now it is time to share the game Crazy Road as a type-in. Now the main part of the program, the game loop, runs from line 50 to line 120. And you'll see at line 120, we've got our ATTR, our attribute command there for Y and X. Y and X being the little car. And I've asked it to equal zero, zero being black, that's the paper color. So if it equals black, the car will print. If the car equals red or another color like the green for the grass, it will then skip past that line and it carries out the commands to, for the, um, the collision. So either lose a life or game over. It's a very simple program. There's not really a lot to it. What makes the game is that scrolling. So have some fun with it. Feel free to change the user defined graphics, change the colors, make it your own. And just have some fun with it. As always, thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Take care of yourselves.